everyone, video number 17, and I am focusing on building the roof this week. I have to figure out how to create a foam shell over all of this. Now remember, this has to move up and down, so I'm going to have some sort of pivot point right here. I'm just going to start putting up some cardboard to, uh, to try to trace the, the shape that I need for the side first, I think. I have come up with a sketch and here we go. That is going to be the shape of the side of the roof. Since I've run out of that plastic that I used for structure before, I just went out and got some of this foam core and I'll see if that works. I think it's funny that now that I've got that top piece on, this looks like the front. <laughs> like a miniature cockpit. If you're wondering why I'm working on the floor, it's because I have my desk full of stuff that I'm soldering. Anyway, I've cut out a couple more pieces and just gotta continue gluing them together. was not easy to do. I've decided that I really like working with this foam core. I just hope that it's uh, durable enough. Just gonna reinforce this corner. So after getting all of these pieces together, I added some more foam core on here just for some support, mostly to keep the sides in because they were kind of flaring out. So I'll continue to do that as I build the rest, building the front of it. I spent the last hour or so making these. This is just the foam that goes around the PVC pipe on the canopy and just cutting out all the pieces and gluing them together probably the most tedious part of this entire build. That's all the foam I have left. I'm going to need more. I am out of breath. It is a lot of work just making these cuts to make these strips. Got a bunch of this conduit made. And I've started putting it around the PVC on the canopy and it's going on fairly well. It's just taken a long time to do because it's so much gluing. Before I can put these pieces of the foam strip on, I have to drill the holes for mounting the controls. I'm going to put some holes right there and there and I have to build the rest of the box because it's going to be at an angle and that's how it's going to fasten on so I have to do a bit more sheet metal work. I just so happen to have one of these rubber rings to go into the hole to protect the wires. Because it is kind of sharp still. I just hope I can get it in here. Using a magnet to clean up my shavings. After a whole lot of tweaking and adjusting and cutting to make it fit. 
it does. Now it's ready to fit onto the canopy. Right about there. So I have a hole there and a hole there and a bolt. Now I'm going to put another hole down here and on the other side and that will keep it steady. As the pilot, this is what you would see. So now I can continue with putting the rest of the foam on here. The wire is going to go into some conduit and just be strapped up. And that's all I have time for this week. I am pretty happy with how much progress I made on getting the foam installed, especially with getting the, the roof done. And the control panel is looking really nice now that it has the rest of the box on it. I still have more wires that I have to put in there, but I can continue on with the foam because I have the spot for the control panel now. So thank you very much for watching. Do the like and subscribe, and I'll see you guys later.